What are you looking moody for? What's moody. You, what go on, fam? <laughs> what's your bye-bye idea? Don't do that. Oh, oh shit. Oh, what's wrong with the cow? <laughs> Excuse me, have Tesco got an offer on? <laughs> Has Tesco got an offer on? Oi! Oi! Say hello to the camera! Say hello to the camera! Hello camera! I'm sorry, but as a true South Londoner, Croydon South Londoner, yeah, I've never seen a chicken shop with a seating capacity of 200. And on top of that, it's got carpet, bro. He's got a chicken shop with carpet. My gosh. So I'm here and I'm like, raw. Raw. Hella seats. Bro. More seating at the back. <laughs> Taking the piss. Oh. Why are you running? Why are you running? Yeah? What? You owe me money. Excuse me, officer. Yeah? You coming in the video? I'm sorry. I'm, in the, I'm directing here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Oh, it's funny now, is it? Is this funny to you? Go! <laughs> you right there, mate? Yeah, I'm all right. What's the problem here, then, eh? What, what are you doing here? Uh, what do you mean, what? Uh, uh, what's well, I've got problem? a four-year-old trying to sleep. Okay. I've got a four-year-old trying to sleep in there, mate. But, mate, it's the middle of the day. Do you not know how kids work? Okay, they yeah, have a nap like, in the middle of the day. Okay, but they? like, what's the issue though? The issue is you're sitting here revving your engine like you're 17 years old. I mean, he looks 35. So what's going on? Like, you're no, not no, boy racers no, no more, no, are you? No, no, but hold a minute, yeah, mate. We're not revving the engine. The engine is just loud. I can see his foot on the bloody pedal, mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's doing it now just because you're here. Oh, oh, so you start because I'm here. So you, so now I've told you I've got a kid trying to sleep. You think it's funny? You're going to come and wake the kid up, are you? Is that what you're going to do? You're going to start beeping the horn as well? So I'll really get someone out onto you. Shall I call the police on you? Well, no, because he's not going to beep at anyone. There's, there's, there's no car in front of us. Yeah, but I've told you. I've told you you need to be quiet. And yeah, your attitude to that is now that's why he's revving but the car. Like, yeah, 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 the only one who's not being quiet is you. You've come out here shouting at us, trying to tell us off. Oh, so me talking at a little slightly elevated volume is going to make my if kid you, up inside, if, yeah? If, if, or if, your car going vroom, If you think vroom, about vroom, this vroom. now, yeah, your kid is actually home alone oh, right now. you're such big boys, aren't you, with your special car? Yeah, but like, your kid is home alone right now. So like, shouldn't you go tend to that? My wife's in there. Oh, that's great for you, mate. Yeah, and my wife is going to be stressed out trying to deal with a kid waking up because you But can't... that's not our issue, though, is it? But what are you doing around here, anyway? We're you don't live we're, here. We're waiting for a friend. What friend? Yeah, well, you don't have a friend around here. Yeah, we do. Who's your friend, then? It's none of your business. You, who is it? Our neighbourhood watch around here, mate. All I right. know everyone in this street. I know everyone's business, so it is my business. Okay. You tell me it's not my business. Stop revving your engine! 
Me? You're going to wake up your four-year-old. Oh, what, by shouting? Well, yeah, because you're shouting right now. Everyone ever, ever hear you on the bloody street. Just go. Disappear. But, what do you mean, just go? Just go. You don't need... You've got no business around here. We're waiting for our friend. Well, your friend can catch up with you later. Off your pop. But what do you mean, off our pop? Do you, have trouble, do you have trouble understanding me, mate? Do you, we are all waiting for our friend. Do you not understand that? You're waiting for your friend. So... Yes. yes. Did you think to text your friend and maybe get him to come we out We have texted our friend. We have texted our friend. We right, want well, him to come outside. Maybe you give him a call and then you absolutely get okay. the hell out of here. And maybe you go back inside your house and look after your four-year-old. Your, your four the four-year-old who's trying to sleep, who's probably having a paddy right now because of your absolute immature behaviour. Or maybe it's because... You think you're like... What, what do you think you are? Like 17, 18 years old? You're going to do some donuts in the street next, are you, mate? Well, no. Because you've got a big sporty car. What's it compensating for, eh? Alright, mate, you don't, don't need to get personal, do you? Well, I do need to get personal, because you're in my street, waking up my kid, causing bother when you don't need to! But your kid should, shouldn't be asleep anyway. Oh, it's funny awake. now, is it? Is this funny to you? Go! And an investigation is underway after a number of offensive Barbie-themed posters appeared on London bus stops targeting Conservative MPs. The images used derogatory language and focused on the government's immigration policy. They're placed behind glass advert panels, but it's unclear who opened them. TfL said the posters weren't authorised by them or their advertising partner. <laughs> Don't go to mechanic, go to your local priest. <laughs> What's in it? Hi, fluffy socks are brilliant, aren't they? I love them too. <laughs> Excuse me, mate. Do you know the quickest way to Winfield? What, you're driving or you're walking? I'm driving. Yeah, that's the quickest way. <laughs> Does anyone just like to live in London and finish our hospitality shift and then walk to the station and go? <sighs> that was hard. Stop him and kill my corona! Hot tight JJ inside the plane. You stop it, kick with about four buttons. We're coming, that's right, and we got this stopping ace. Big back. Look, camera. 